Cape Town when you were local, you take security seriously. First you have your fence and gate. Then the garage door. And then the gate in front of your door. Welcome home. Today, we try to climb Table Mountain. All right, the fun starts here. Up here, then all the way up. Apparently, it's supposed to take like two or three hours. We'll see how long it does. Let's go. How you doing? So, made it to the top. Paulina, made it to the top before I did. Barry, not so much. Tundi, we're still waiting for. <laughs> this was an epic, epic journey. For me, anyway. The guy said it was gonna be two hours. I think we're pushing three plus. Uh, definitely Paulina could've got, like, got you up a lot faster. She wasn't waiting for us. However, we made it. We made it. So that's the trail we came up down that way. Uh, you can kind of go this way, or you can go all the way up that way. That's the summit up there, and you're on top of Table Mountain. And going back that way, we will take the car down, the cable car down, and enjoy one or two beers. Not gonna lie.
We're now in Hout Bay, checking out the market. Cape Town is in the midst of a drought that's been going on for many years. Uh, in fact, last year they almost became the first modern city to run out of water. Through conservation and uh, some rain, they've managed to push back day zero and not yet run out of water. Uh, and here's some of the things that they do to conserve water.
know about that view. And just like that, we're back at the airport and our visit in Cape Town is over. Not my usual travel video, but uh, an important one for me nonetheless. Hope you enjoyed it and we'll see you next time.